five, four, it's already three, two, one. What's going on everybody? It's California Farmer, Ryan Valk, and I'm here with my wife, Shalyn, my sister, Janessa, and we are gonna try out Blue Diamond's latest product that they just came out with, the almond protein powder. I am not a huge gym goer. I've definitely had my gym time before and I've had protein powders and I've never really been a huge protein powder fan. So if my reaction isn't the greatest, pay attention to these two because they are currently going to the gym and they currently like protein powder. So I'm very picky, very, very picky about my protein powder. I don't like the texture a lot of okay. them, but I do want something. I like that these are clean. Like they don't have a lot of extra added ingredients that are in the other like whey protein and stuff like that they, that they put in it to make it taste good. And I like plant-based protein. And it's not pea protein, which is nice. It's almond protein. So we'll see how that goes. The unsweetened kind is just almond protein powder. That's it. One ingredient. One ingredient. The total fat is six grams, and protein is obviously the 20 grams. There's seven grams of fiber in this one. The vanilla is only almond protein powder, sea salt, natural flavors, and monk fruit extract, and 20 grams of protein. There's seven grams of fiber in this and six grams of fat. There are 16 grams of carbs in there for those who are watching that, but like I said, that seven of that is fiber. The chocolate is protein powder, cocoa powder, Sea salt, monk fruit extract, and natural flavor. So, five ingredients in that. Like I said, these two are the pros and the ones you want to listen to. I'm probably going to say that I want to add some ice cream or add something to this. So, all that we added was unsweetened vanilla almond milk, the almond breeze kind, just because that's usually what I use for protein when I make my protein shakes. Obviously, people use these for like adding strawberries and other delicious things and to it, but and pancakes and yeah. they use them for actual cooking. Yeah, like I feel like the unsweetened kind could be used for that. Yeah. Well, I say let's just jump right into it. We are going to start with the dark chocolate. It so. smells good. Yeah. So a lot of time protein powder smells kind of gross. Like this, right when we opened good. it, it smelled really good. It does smell good. It's thick. I made them. Very thick. thick. <laughs> but it's not bad. No. That's not bad at all. Compared to like the other plant protein powders that I've had, it's definitely a lot better. I like the taste a lot better. Yeah, I feel like we just um, have the consistency wrong, but taste wise, I think it is. No, I think it tastes good. Yeah. And it's dark chocolate. So yeah, it's so weird. it's. It's not going to be as sweet as like your milk chocolate flavors and other stuff. And it's sweetened with what? Monk? Is that monk fruit extract? I don't even know what that is. No, I could, I could totally food. drink a whole thing of this, I feel like, without feeling like I'm the, gagging. The, the, texture, the texture is pretty thick. Yeah. So yeah, we, don't have the, we don't have the consistency right, but it tastes, I think it tastes good. I, it's so much better than the other. The yeah. proteins that I the remember, protein the proteins that I remember taking 10 years ago, that was probably the last time I've actually used protein powder. They were pretty nasty, so that was actually pretty pleasant. And the texture isn't... Like, it's just got this... Sometimes I have to, like, plug my nose when I drink protein shakes just to get it over with, and this is actually... Yeah, I feel like and I the texture is fine. All right, so we're going to move on to the vanilla. This one smells like cookies or birthday cake when you open it. Like, I do taste the almond, I so... And the vanilla. I taste the vanilla in it. Yeah. I, I like the chocolate better, but for, like... My post workout protein shake, but I feel like this would be really good mixed with like if you yeah mixed with something pancakes or strawberries or <clears throat> any type of smoothie that you make. This would be really yeah. good. Yeah, I agree. I feel like this I could just drink a whole thing of. Where this is a little more I'd rather maybe mix it with something. I would want to mix it with some kind of fruit. I, I think, think if I could mix it in with like a birthday it. cake uh, with lots of frosting, I could I could really see myself enjoying this cream a lot. On top. Exactly, precisely. <laughs> On to the next one. So this one's going to be interesting because this is just the unsweetened just almond protein. Almond. This is something you probably obviously would add some flavoring to. Or yeah, or add into like when you make protein pancakes. Yeah, it's strawberries. But like, I feel like when I've made breakfast and stuff, I have... That is definitely something you add to something. It's not that bad. bad. <laughs> like you can drink like... protein powder. You can drink this. Yeah, that's almond. Mm. It, it tastes like that tastes like it's like a it's like the almond milk but a lot stronger it tastes like the liquid version of eating almonds <laughs> just raw almonds. <laughs> this tastes like a lot more um intense almond milk 
Yeah, I actually don't like, like it. I actually kind of like it. Almond milk, but okay. <laughs> it's not that bad. <laughs> All right, so to conclude, like to conclude, who, favorites. I'm picking mine as the dark chocolate is my favorite. Yeah, yeah, chocolate's my favorite definitely. I, I like them all for different reasons. Actually, this one isn't as bad as I thought it would be. I was nervous, but this is not bad. What? We had a producer come over and whisper something in our ears. <laughs> she yeah, wants right. us to tell us where we can get it at. Where can we get this product at? Amazon. Amazon. Amazon you can go buy these on Amazon. So yeah, go on Amazon. Uh, if you're looking for a plant-based protein powder, I liked the I dark like chocolate. That. She liked all three. How did you feel? I liked all three. I want to just drink these two. I still think they're fine though. Yeah. I want to just like this one. Well, like, I think majority of they were people mixed will with something. Them. Yeah. Mixed if they were mixed something, something that'd be fine. But this one I could just drink. Yeah. yeah. I agree. But I think they'd be really good mixed with stuff for smoothies. Ryder, my, my son even likes the chocolate. Will you try chocolate? That's when you like. Yeah. Well, thank you guys for watching this. And if you guys are interested, go get some off of Amazon and buy our product because we appreciate all of the business that you guys help us out as almond growers. And uh, we'll catch you next time.